In Lawrence, fire destroying a package store and a cake factory. Crews found heavy smoke and flames inside the liquor store on Essex Street. WBZ's Katrina Kincaid is live at that scene. Katrina, what can you tell us at this point? Liam and Kate, well, it still very much smells like smoke here. You can see the smoke for miles. Right now, they are still putting water into that liquor store, Sweeney's, here on Essex Street in Lawrence. The fire chief said that they got a call around 4 a.m. for the fire here, and they saw that the liquor store, as you mentioned, was the one that they saw on fire. The bakery next door is also what caught fire as well. Fire chief believes that the liquor store, though, is where that fire started, but they are not 100% positive. Luckily, no one was inside the bakery at the time of the fire, but it was incredibly heavy fire when firefighters arrived here, so much so they had to pull back. Well, we had to pull companies out. The deputy very aggressively struck alarm, second and third alarm. So now we're outside. We have uh, three alarms plus. So we have four ladders operating, big ground ladders, uh, ground guns. Nobody's been injured. Uh, nobody's homeless. Nobody lives there, but both both those cake factory and the package are total losses. And I just spoke with the owner of the bakery. She is very upset. She's been here since 4.30 in the morning. We actually know her on WBZ. We interviewed her for Hispanic Heritage Month to feature this bakery. She tells us that as upset as she is, she is so grateful for just how many people have come out this morning, including the mayor of Lawrence, to support her. In Lawrence, Katrina Kincaid for the Morning Mix.